Very rarely you will find crochet patches that can help you understand the news. These can, because I have crocheted the infectiousness of the coronavirus, commonly known in the news as the R number. The R denotes reproduction. If the R number is 1, this means that each infected person will on average infect one new person during the course of the disease. If R equals 2, each infected person will infect two persons. And if R equals 3, then each infected person will infect three persons, and so forth. In this patch, I have crocheted R is 1. We start out with 10 infected persons up here. In the next generation of the disease, it will still be 10, and still 10, and still 10, also after nine generations. A disease with R is 1 will always be present, but the number of infected persons will be constant. So, if the society can handle the disease burden today, it can also be under control the next week, the next month, and the next year. If the R number falls below 1, the number of infected people will decrease and the disease will vanish. This is what you see in this patch. This shows R is 0.9. Here, the 10 infected persons will give rise to 9 new cases, and after 9 generations, we will only see 4 new cases. With R equals 0.8, there will only be 1 new case after 9 generations. And with R is 0.5, there are no new cases after six generations. This is what we would like to obtain. But for the coronavirus, the R is mostly larger than 1. Here is a patch showing R equals 1.1, where 10 infected people give rise to 11 new cases. R equals 1.2 and with R equals 1.5, it is evident that we have a problem. Even the crochet patch kind of crumbles. And research results suggest that the R number for the coronavirus, uh, if we do nothing to prevent the spread, may be, may be not only 1.5, but between 2 and 3, or even as high as 6. I have not crocheted the worst scenarios, but I can show you how it looks for R equals 2. With R equals 2, the 10 original persons, or infected, will give rise to 2,560 new cases after 9 generations. And if R increase further, not to 3 or 6, but just to 2.5, the situation looks horrible. Let me take it up. After nine generations, we have as much as 15,259 new cases from the original 10. Uh, with so many infected persons, some of them will surely die. This is why we have to follow the official recommendations like washing hands and keeping distance. And if we act responsible, we might reduce the spread, not from 2.5 to 2, not to 1.5, not to 1.1, but to an R number below 1. And then we might also keep it this way until a vaccine is ready.